Hello and welcome back. In this video, we will talk about the first operator within the adapter list. And that's, of course, the matrix to vectors. We can use this adapter operator to convert a matrix to vector. And we know from previous videos that a matrix is consist of four vectors. And uh, if you want to change that, and make them separated you can use this operator so let's just grab this cube and put it into Expresso. so let's extract its global matrix hit control and double click that name to make the size of this window fit the name of global matrix and connect that to the matrix within this operator and then let's just grab a bunch of result nodes just to see what's going on with this kind of changing data types so let's just make a couple of these by control and dragging these to make copies all right let's connect all of these things to the output ports of this matrix to vectors operator all of these result nodes are real so let's just select them all together and change their data type to vector and now let's just extract another one and make its data type matrix. And let's just hold control and double click that name to resize the window. And uh, let's just connect it to the uh, global matrix in that cube. So this is the matrix kind of data type. And it consists of four vectors, like we said before. And this fourth set of numbers is representing the position. And uh, these three uh, is representing the orientation of any given object. And of course, we talked about the matrix data type in a previous video. I'm going to put a link down in the description for you to see that if you haven't already. So that was it for this operator. And of course, last thing that we can say about this, that we do have another operator, which called vectors to matrix. And what it does is the opposite. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.